We're out here at Mount Greville. We're going up Waterfall Gorge and then back down Southeast Ridge. So this car, this hike's about six kilometers long. Yep. Uh, how fast do you reckon we're going to do it? One hour. <laughs> One hour. What's the time now? Eight thirty-one. I guess we better start running. <laughs> I've also got my Strava on, so we can see exactly how long it takes. Right. Oh, so we've just turned off onto the waterfall gorge section. This is the route we're chosen to take up. Should be pretty interesting. They say it's not marked at all, this track, but it looks pretty marked to me, Heritage. Hey, yeah, that's pretty descriptive. Check out this little gorge we get to walk through. It's cool. pretty sick. This is like a waterfall gorge or something, I reckon. <laughs> Classic Richard. <laughs> I, <laughs> I don't know if there's any water in it. Waterfall gorge. That does not bode well for us. <laughs> no, it doesn't. If you did this in the wet, it would be a death wish. You'd be sliding all the way down to the bottom. I'm just imagining a torrent of raging rapids coming down this. Could you imagine that? It would be uh, rapid, that's for sure. Yeah. Good demise. <laughs> what would you say about this kind of rock? I wouldn't take it for granite. <laughs> The sad thing is he knew exactly what to say when I asked that question. Here we have a wild Richard in his natural habitat. Navigating the palm fronds of the Mount Rebel wilderness. What a lovely path that was not the route. <laughs> Look at that clear cut, longer path. Right, oh, so it looks like we're nearly out of the gorge, hey, Richard? Yeah, it does look like that. Should be nice to get into some different terrain for a bit. Definitely not uh, best shape for the hike, but I'll get through it. She'll be right. Sure it is a very different style of hiking. I don't think we've done a trail like this. It's maybe close to Carnarvon Gorge kind of vibe, but yeah. a lot more elevation. It does reconnect, hey? Um, yeah, you could probably come over from where I am. Here we are. Not a bad climb. No. I might cut back through here. Yeah. We were on some pretty rough overgrown bush terrain, but seems to have cleared up now a little bit. Got a decent view out there. Should be uh, not too far from the summit now. Yeah. Another half an hour maybe. Uh, we come out to some decent view. Yeah. It's a nice view. I'll yeah. take a photo of that. Yeah, check out these views. If this must be what they call a slab or something along those lines. Wow. Holy, that's cool. Oh, that's quite a view. I don't think the camera's going to do this one justice. No. Alright, so when you get about maybe two thirds of the way up, you pop out of the gorge and you're greeted by this absolutely epic rock slab. And honestly, 
on a today on a day like today this might be some of the best views you'll ever see so i still don't think it's the main way I feel like we've kind of lost the track a bit. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah. We might just find it. Yeah, so if you ever find yourself not on the trail, first um, like giveaway that you're not on the trail is the track does not look worn. It's at that point that you need to figure out where the trail is supposed to be and head to it. Or backtrack. But trust me, do it as early as possible, hey Richard? Like we were, we, we went the wrong way on Barney. I think it took us an extra two hours of travel time. And that was, that was not fun. Do you think you could actually survive the Seven Peaks Challenge? Uh, I think I could get through it, but it would be tough. Oof. Not like before where you're like, oh, Seven Peaks is gonna be easy though. Yeah, incline or elevation change is just not, not, not trained by running and walking. You just can't train it. No. When you come up these tracks, you have all these little kangaroo paws. Looks like we made it to the top, Richard. Yeah, boy. Here's your rock stack. Nice. Someone went over the top with that. Okay, so we've made it to the top here. Check out this epic drop off the cliff. The views are pretty epic of the, you've got main range behind us. You just see it as far as the eye can see. Just... these views behind us yeah. you just would have seen some epic shots from the drone it's honestly stunning we're on the southeast ridge track right now heading back down the peak supposed to be some good views of barney down here a little bit cool yeah not nothing like the other track we were just on i think that was a lot better so far but yeah this is cool nonetheless a bit more direct and that must be palm gorge down there i can see some palm trees in it yeah and we'll be on the ridge right now so that's barney you can see Barney from here. Hey Richard, where are we? We're back at the, uh, where the trail is joined. Final stretch. That's the uh, fire, final fire trail. 